Hi, welcome back to a new video and welcome back to the Kerr Cage. This episode I want to try one of those jar terrariums that this dude on YouTube, that Serpa design, I think I'm saying that right. But he does a lot of jar terrariums and stuff and I showed you a little bit in the last video of that one I was playing with, experimenting with. I think I found a jar that is a little bit better you know, it's clear, there's not as many waves and defects in it. But, yeah guys, I'm going to start on that. And I'll start with the false bottom as his little design. And, uh, yeah, let's get started. Well, everybody, I uh, cut out this little piece of uh, window screen. It's pretty ratty because I found it outside. It's not really the best, but it's what I got to work with. And it's oversized, so that way it can kind of curl up on the edges. And I got some rocks that I can put in the bottom. But yeah, let's uh, let's put some rocks in there. Then put the false bottom. Then I'll go get some of my. Uh, dirt mix and I'll be back well everybody I got the uh, mesh screen in and a small layer of rocks to help hold it down now I want to go get my charcoal and put a small layer of that in there and some dirt and then we can kind of escape this thing a little bit I want it to be basically mainly plants and just a little bit of you know, some rocks or twigs or whatever. But yeah, let's go get the carbon and the uh, uh, dirt. And uh, yeah, be back. Well, let's uh, let's put the the carbon in. I just want a small layer, just enough to kind of help purify things a little bit. Sorry it's a little dark, but my lights ain't very the brightest. Take the tweezers and let's kind of just push it around. And, uh, yeah, I think that's pretty good. I think that's fairly good. Let's put the dirt in. Uh, I'm going to cut and put it in because I want to make sure this step is you know fairly good and everything but yeah let's come back in a little bit well guys I'm back I put a good little layer of dirt in there I got the rocks, the carbon, the mesh divider and uh, yeah now pretty much the only thing we need to do is uh, put some plants in there and a little bit of Oh yeah, the hardscape. Let me go get some of that. Well guys, here's my three hardscaping materials. I want to, like I said, I want to keep this simple. All I got is two rocks and a stick. But yeah, let's... Let's put that in there and see how that goes. Okay guys, I went outside and grabbed a couple of extra sticks. Because it does look kind of bare in there with just one stick and a couple rocks. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to put them in there. Let you see that. And then we're going to go outside and find some more plants. Or find some plants to put in here. I don't really know what, but we'll see what's out there. Okay, but I kind of played with it for a little bit. And uh, I kind of like this. Oh. I got the two rocks in the back with this curvy stick right here in the back. That Y stick right there. This arching stick right here. And this other curvy stick a little bit towards the front. But yeah, let's uh, take and start planting some stuff in there. And uh, I plan on taking you guys out there with me so I guess let's go well everybody I'm out here in the desert 
just off the side of the road pretty much. And I found a couple of plants I kind of want to take. This little clump right here, kind of grassy looking stuff, I want to take that. And I'm probably going to take one of these smaller, I don't know what they are, they're kind of just weeds. I don't think I want any of that because that kind of grows kind of fast. But this stuff right here, let me get out of the light. This stuff right here is a really good carpeting plant. I don't know what it's called. And it's starting to flower. So I'm probably going to take all th three of those plants and uh, probably search for just a little bit more because I ain't got that much room in that jar. But yeah, let's. Uh, Let's uh, take these guys, put them in the plastic ba bag that I brought, and uh, we'll go from there. See you guys in a bit. Well, everybody, I got all three kinds of the uh, plant in there. And uh, let's keep going and see what else we can find. Well, everybody, I think I found a different species of grass stuff that I got in the bag. I think it's that stuff that I got. I think it's that stuff that I got. And it's uh, a little bit thicker leaf than this. I think this is some sort of grass. But yeah, let's put that in the bag and uh, keep going. Well, guys, I found one more different type of plant. Hey, there, girl. Be quiet. Uh, but yeah, I think I found one different type of plant. Uh, let me see if I can find it again. Here we go. It's kind of a broad leaf and it's different type, so I'm going to dig that up, put it in the bag, and I think that's going to be it for that. For that. Because you got to remember, I, I just got a small little jar. But anyway, let's dig that up, put it in the bag, and uh, I think we'll just go home after that. But yeah, see you guys. Uh, see you guys when I get home, I guess, or when I find a different type of plant or something. But yeah. Okay guys, I think I found one more plant to try to put in the bag. This is going to be it because I ain't got no more room that I could use. It looks like this is, it's really red. But yeah, let's uh, put that in the bag and we'll be done. Okay guys, I found one more thing I want to take and that's just because you don't see this very often in Arizona. This is some moss that is growing, and I need to, well, I don't need to, but I really want to take this, because, like I said, you can't really find this in Arizona. So, I'm going to put this in the bag, and we're going to go home. And, uh, yeah, see you guys when uh, I get back home and start doing the, the planting. Okay, everybody, I'm back home. Here's the jar. Here's the uh, plants I was able to get. I got some nice pieces of moss, some different types of like, almost like grass, but I don't think they're grass. Some like broadleaf stuff. And uh, yeah, let's let's plant and see how it all goes. Okay, I got everything out of the uh, bag. And uh, these moss, these pieces of moss, they got a lot of dirt on them. So I think I'm going to like soak them or spray them down with a squirt bottle. And try to get as much dirt off them as I can. But I think that's what's mainly holding them together. But let's take and plant those plants, the rooted plants. And uh, yeah, then we'll take care of the moss. Well, everybody, uh, I'm pretty much about done planting. I've planted pretty much everything I can. And you can see I got a big clump of that hair right there. Hair grass, whatever it is. I got another clump pretty much right by it. The thicker, whiter leaf right there. And I stuck a little bit of moss right there in... You know, right there in between. And I stuck 
the longer kind of carpeting plant right here in the back kind of spreads out to either end that will grow in fairly nicely I know that this plant is very hardy because I ripped up a plant like this and just took a little piece with a little root on it and it took hold in my other uh, jar and then I stuck I don't know if you're going to be able to see it, but right back in there, in between the rocks, I stuck one of these in there. I got still got the other one and a bunch of moss. I'm probably going to put in the other one. And, or no, wait, that's that right there. Here, let me get a pointer right here. That's the red stuff. Back there is that broadleaf stuff. Here's the fatter beef stuff. And uh, yeah, let's go from a top point of view. It's to set you on right there. But yeah, you can see the broad leaf, right? And, um, right there, there's the broad leaf. There's the kind of grassy stuff. There's the thick grass. There's the spread out kind of carpeting and stuff. And right there in between, right there, is a small clump of moss. We'll see how this goes and the rest of this moss and that one plant, I'm probably going to put in the, uh, in the other uh, jar terrarium. But uh, yeah, I think that's about it for now. As always guys, thank you guys for watching. I'll update you guys uh, probably next video. Or no, next video. I'm going to try to get some bugs to put in here. Some really pulleys. And you know, whatever else I can find. But yeah. Got a cool little, cool little jar. We'll see how this goes, but yeah, I'm going to put the rest of that in the other jar and uh, see how that goes. But thank you all for watching. Come back anytime. Uh, but yeah, the next video I'm going to go try to find some bugs. Watch out for that one. Anyway, guys, goodbye and see you guys next time.